Well, I drove it. I'm just outside of Springfield, Illinois at the moment. And uh, you won't believe the gas mileage I got with this. 9.8 mile a gallon. I know. I agree with you. Except there's one problem. I don't have any power. Uh, just no power whatsoever. I don't know what's going on. I'm going to figure it out. Um, it's got to be something simple. I'm going to check timing and check a couple other things. Uh, also ch check to see if the catalytic converter might be plugged up causing an issue. But you know what? Right now, I'm not going to stress about it. And I'll tell you why. I've stressed about it since the moment I started having issues with it. But what I'm going to go do right now is I'm going over here to the Route 66 Museum over here. And I'm going to go eat, relax, and enjoy it. And forget about this thing for a little while. But yeah, I'm going to get it off my mind. Let's go over here and check it out and get something to eat. Here we are at Route 66 Motorhead's Bar and Grill. They got the couple little drag cars up there. Got the... Uh, light it's kind of cool like I said I'm gonna go and get me something to eat so you got some cool stuff in here got a racing go-kart another racing go-kart little Harley Davidson bike there got another bike here This is a Thank you. 1971 BSA B50 MX 500 CC. But they also got this one here. This is the Lincoln bike. I really like this. Got the pennies in there. Hair cleaners. Oh, Abe Lincoln's hat. Yeah, it looks nice. And then they got another chopper here. Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm going to ride that and go get the contract of San Vaganza. See if y'all know who that uh, video is. I'll tell you in the later part of the video what this bike reminds me of. <laughs> Let's go get something to eat. Well, uh, my part come in for my Cadillac converter uh, delete part. Um, this is just a something to get me going right now. I just spent another $130 here on exhaust stuff. Uh, I've got new muffler, the pipe that goes on to the engine part up there, new clamps, new pipe. Now I got to crawl under there and cut all the old stuff off. Got my exhaust pipe coming down, that big flange thing here. That's the, the big piece that I showed you. Calic converter, and it goes down to an intermediate pipe into the muffler back there thing is when I left here where I'm at right now uh, in Bloomington to go to Springfield it run like a dog I mean just no power whatsoever absolutely no power so I was like crap it's kind of like converter so that's when I ordered the delete pipe flange which is considered a catalytic converter repair piece that was hundred and ten dollars and then yesterday I or when it come in the other day pulled a catalytic converter down and it was empty hollow just like my hopes and dreams of getting this fixed but 
anyway uh that kind of i was like oh you know i'm like okay and now i'm back to square one checked fuel pressure again it was a little low uh pulled the pump off took it in it was under warranty got it replaced put it back on now my fuel pressure is a lot better than what it was but i already got this pipe and i'm still not 100 percent sure that the fuel pump was the whole issue but i'm leaning 75 percent sure on that and 25 percent that it's probably still something with the muffler maybe so i'm eliminating that problem right now putting a new muffler on it new pipe and all that so i'm going to crawl up under there and get all this here kind of cut out so i can get this thing here done i'm tired of messing with this i need to be on the road i've done spent more than what i should have but you gotta you know i gotta have it uh, it's my livelihood it makes me my bread and butter so gotta fix it so i'm going to uh get this cut off and i'll show you what everything is once i get it out well i got all the old exhaust out that was a catalytic converter uh the tubes up here was for air pipes i have an air pump that's on here that i'll be able to get a shorter belt and eliminate the air pump freeing up extra horsepower then I come in with an, a little pipe and there's that muffler that thing is long as you can tell it says Ford on it but you can see where it's swollen here but 30 inches long versus 15 I believe 30 inches long right there versus 14 inches long I can tell you with this muffler it's going to breathe a lot better I got my pipe catalytic converter is empty I'll show you pour it out hey you can see through it but now I'm going to get this all put together. I did kind of put the muffler on there on that short little pipe and cranked it up for a second to see how it sounded. It sounded good. But the real test is once I get it all done and then it goes through all the pipe and I hear it back here. It's going to be a little louder. But it's going to be a nice sound. Nice sound for an RV, that's for sure. See the flange I put up there? I reduced it from three inch to two and a half. I wanted to run three inch all the way, but the muffler is two and a half. It's two and a half all the way down, all the way back from the muffler to the tailpipe is three inches. Made my own hangers. Clamps are to the side so they don't grab nothing underneath. So tomorrow, I'm gonna go give it a drive. See how it does. The dog's telling me hello. <laughs> but I'm gonna go give it a drive tomorrow. See how it does, see how it sounds. But I do like that sound. But more importantly than sound is how it's going to work now that muffler uh the muffler was only like 44 dollars i was planning on 50 to 100 dollars for a muffler i wanted something more free flowing uh some of them i looked at i looked at walker mufflers it's the way some of them are designed the inlet is a certain way and the outlet is, an, you know, has to be a certain way. Uh, with this one here, I can do it either way, which is what I want because I needed a center in and a offset out. That's what this one was. 
can't beat it i like i really do like the sound of it it's got that nice throaty sound so i'm gonna go give it a little gas so you can hear it for the breakdown of everything I've done I don't remember the cost of exactly of everything I remember the cost of most of the stuffs but uh, where I remember where I have the receipts handy I'll list everything so let's uh let's see what this trips cost me well as you can tell I'm sitting still haha <laughs> But, I already took it down the interstate. This thing, it gets up and goes. It has the power. Uh, got my brother with me. He wanted to go for a ride. I love the sound out of this thing, so I'll let y'all be able to hear the sound out of it.